So time management for me is a skill. We have 24 hours in a day that we must manage. We have 168 hours in a week that we must manage. There's a lot of opportunities within those times. And we must learn to prioritize ourselves and our time on what is important within the time that we have. So something that people don't do a lot of or enough of is trying to prioritize health within to that 168 hours in a week, within that 24 hours in a day. I always say to people that three 20 minute sessions a week is one hour out of your 168 hours. And if we can't find that one hour, then I feel that there is something drastically going wrong within your planning and your structure and your priority. Three 20 minute sessions a week is gonna make a massive difference. Finding quality time at home is gonna make a difference to your relationships. It's gonna make a difference to your happiness. If you're sat on your sofa with your laptop out or your phone out and you're well working at seven o'clock at night or your missus is across from you or your kids are playing on the floor, you are in theory saying that this laptop and this work is more important than you. They're sitting there looking at you going, we're here. You're sitting on there going, I'm working. Great, you're working. Getting the priorities wrong. This is what I'm talking about. Finding your priorities. Having a cutoff time for when you're at home. Is your business gonna close down overnight because you're not dropping an email? Are you not gonna be able to grow just because you're not working between seven and 11? You dictate your work. You dictate your hours. Sure, sometimes it needs some evening work and some detailed work every now and then if you're launching a product or if you're launching a brand new campaign. I'm sure your wife and kids can understand every now and then when it has to happen, but if you're at home most nights and you're working and replying to customers and on the phone, it's bound to break down at some point. If you're not focusing on your health, if you're not concentrating on your health, then your health is bound to be affected at some point, which is going to affect your work overall anyway. How can you work if you're not fit and well? If your blood pressure's high, if your cholesterol's high? You've got to get the priorities right when it comes to time management. If you're not getting the priorities right, you're cuffing it. If you're not planning, you're cuffing. And cuffing leads to a lottery. Some days you might have a good day, sometimes you're not. But it means you're out of control and it means your anxiety is through the roof which creates depression over a long period of time and unhappiness, unfulfillness, a lack of identity. So next time you're planning, prioritize the tasks that are most important. Get them in first before you start worrying about the things that really do not matter or move the needle forward.